Hello everyone, today we are going to be fixing and printing one of our XXXL custom mouse pads. Alright today we have a super pretty Genshin Impact design. So this image has a few issues that likely happened when it was resized, like this line here. We are going to have to clean these up by hand but that's perfectly okay. Okay, let's get started. First things first let's use the blend tool to fix these lines along the edges. If you are enjoying the video so far, please don't forget to like and subscribe, thank you. For marks like these we only need to get rid of the bigger stuff as the smaller bits won't show up on the mat once it's printed. As we mentioned at the start, these lines and marks normally show up when the resizing process is rushed. I have not played much Genshin myself but I've always been able to appreciate the art style of the landscapes, this being a perfect example. And these kinds of blues are going to come out incredible on the final product, especially with the darker background. Let me know in the comments if I'm wrong but I think this character is Haizu solely based off of the hairstyle but I really don't know enough about the game to be sure. When we press these XXXL mats, the lineup becomes way more important. Especially if they have ordered the 5mm one. It's a big mat and can be quite hard to flip without the paper moving. And if it does move around, then the mat can end up looking like this. And that means we have to start over. Because of this we take a little more time with these ones to make sure the tape is secure and put a few extra strips down. Alright let's get it in the press. The press runs super hot so we have to be really careful when we pull the paper back for the reveal. Wow, that looks fantastic, even better than I imagined, the blues really pop. Now we can get it ready to be packed. Pop a silverback toy in for good measure. Shipping label is on so it's ready to be sent off to our happy customer. <laughs> 